Amateur Logic Shorts. While Ray wrestles with the alligator, I'm going to take this screwdriver here and see what's inside this AH705. Okay, nice water seal here around the cabinet. Hmm. The bottom side of the PC board. I'm going to guess from what I'm seeing here, these are more than likely relays. Another row. Another row. Possibly some capacitors on this other side here. Um, I would imagine inductors as well. Some controller components. Not sure what's on the other side, but I don't think I've got time to pull all this apart and completely remove the board there without Ray catching me. I remove these screws around the PC board here. We're going to look inside on the other side of the board. Okay. I can't identify everything that's in here, but I can tell these are a series of latching relays. These are some very good looking uh, toroid inductors. Looks like a couple of rows of capacitors in there. Here's the microcontroller. That is some type of RF shield. I'm not sure exactly what's under there, but it looks like a number of components. Not sure. These could be resistors. These could be capacitors. I don't know. Uh, on the end here, you can see there is the connector for the control and the uh, external power, I believe. And it's kind of interesting. You see these what look like gold-plated contacts right there. Those are for the batteries. This set connects to these ground lugs down here. They're, they're kind of springy. And you notice the B and C connectors stayed in the case there. That's because there's these little clips here that clip around the center conductor. And they've got screws here that actually hold it down secure to the ground connections there. Interesting design. If you enjoy Amateur Logic Shorts, please click the like button. Be sure to click subscribe to be notified when new episodes become available. And let your friends know about this video by clicking share.